Stay there, please. No. Oh, hey. Didn't see you there. I just got back from America. You can tell because I have my bag. And I'm now there. As in, I only just got back and this has been recording ever since I left. Hello, um, I just, yeah, I wanted to make a video. So, for those of you that don't know, I was overseas, I went to Boston to go to PAX, and I met up with uh, Zach, August, and Dice. And as always with the, with these trips that I do, I'm feeling all like motivated and shit, but it makes me be like, yeah, I can do it, I can do it. Every year I hope that, you know, this time will be different because reasons I don't know uh yeah I just want to talk about PAX a little bit basically and one other random topic that's really irrelevant motivation yay PAX doing that for me there'll definitely be like videos from PAX I took a lot of video uh Zach also has some video and shit so he'll be putting up his video at some point so motivation it happened back when we went in 2014 we just kind of like motivated to do shit this year feels a little different because I was kind of I myself was motivated by my friends, who I met up with, as in Dice, Zach, and August. Like, so Dice, you know, he does his own fucking art shit for a living. He just, like, fucking went for it, was able to do it, and was like, fuck yeah, quit his job, and is doing that for a living. There was a video that came out while we were there, a video that he animated for the Music Man, and other shit, he showed us other shit that he just done, and I'm like, man, fucking Dice, Zach, and August, they're both, like, keen for streaming and stuff like that. Yeah. Can't, can't wait to stream and stuff because I like streaming <laughs> and that kind of made me be like man I want to do that and um, yeah I don't really know what else I was gonna say about that type of stuff but uh, if, if those three are watching thank you thank you for showing me a good time and giving me a bit of motivation to do shit hopefully I, I was somehow able to do that shit as well um, <clears throat> and that's, that's the point of this video. Now, the one random thing that, uh, isn't the point of this video, but I want to talk about, because what the fuck, is the movie Downsizing. I watched that on the plane, and I've been thinking about it too much. Which makes me think I don't like the movie. So, it's got Matt Damon in it, he's the, he's the star, and then the trailer leads you to believe that Kristen Wiig, I think that's her name, is the female lead. I'm gonna spoil the fuck out of the movie, just so you know. From memory, the trailer gave me the impression that uh, Matt Damon and Kristen Wiig, you know, became small people because that's the thing in this universe. And then potentially it would lead to like the shenanigans of small people versus normal sized people. And um, I'd be like, okay, cool. Um, great. Basically the plot of the video, the video being a movie, is a scientist discovers how to shrink people and then he he wants everyone to be shrunk because uh, it'll help save the planet. Environmental shit like that, you know? Cool. So that starts happening. Uh, Matt Damon and Kristen Wiig decide, hey, we should do that. And then you're like, okay, cool. The blood of the trailer is happening. And then, and then Kristen Wiig bails. She's like, peace, motherfucker. I don't want to do this shit. And you're like, okay, the plot will be Matt Damon trying to get her back or live a normal life with her being normal and him being small or something like that but when she bails she just is out for the rest of the movie and you're like what the fuck there's also a point before they go little where there's a drunk guy in a bar who's like oh man you're the guys you're the people going small well i think you should have like why do you vote and shit like that and you're like oh man maybe it'll be a movie about you know that type of thing people being racist toward the little people, um, but then it wasn't. That was just like a pointless scene that didn't need to be there. And then Matt Damon was dating someone else, and then some dude, what's his name? Is it Christopher Waltz? Yeah. And then Christopher Waltz's character moves in upstairs and has a party, and then for some reason, and then Matt Damon gets mad at a girlfriend for some reason, I don't remember why, and then goes to the party, gets has 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 the old a drug and then wakes up the next morning and the cleaners are there and then he befriends one of them and then and then people go they go to a, befriends one of them and then helps out the place helps her out and also the, all the people that live in the like slums of where she lives and then they for some reason go to fucking Norway is it Norway I don't remember basically where the scientists scientists who discovered people being had a small people 
how to make people small. They go there <laughs> with the scientist, and and then there's like a cult, and then he goes to go with the cult, but then doesn't go with the cult because the the lady he befriended, the cleaner lady, they actually want to fuck. It was just a weird movie. It took so many turns that I didn't expect. And I was like, what the fuck? So I guess the trailer did well at not, you know, spoiling the entire plot. But also, now that I think about it, did I watch... Did I watch the trailer? I don't remember. Fuck downsizing. I don't like it. And I don't like that it's made me think about it too much. What the fuck? Oh, man. And that's this video. Goodbye. We're in the end slate now, and there's there's tons of tons of has it been twenty seconds? Tons of tons of porn everywhere. Hey, I can delete this note from my phone because I just did the video on it. Delete. Yeah. Nice meme. Porn.